Hi, everybody. Reese Davis with you, bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 pregame show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Boise State's been on a roll lately, but a winning streak is only important if it continues to be a winning streak. By extending it, we'll see if they can get it done in this one. That does it for us here on the NCAA College Football pregame show. Enjoy the game. We'll see you at the half. We're here in Minneapolis, Minnesota, nearby St. Anthony Falls. First down. Gets it out in a hurry. And a nice catch there before he stepped out of bounds. There's very good chemistry between these two. He makes it out to maybe the seven-yard line. Call it a gain of one yard. That brings him second and Throws. He brings it down. Touchdown. And he hits the PAT. A quick update now. Here's Reese. The Orange entered this game ranked number 15 and had their sights set on the top 10. This game was tighter than spandex on a sumo wrestler. Syracuse finishes it off 34-27. Thanks, Reese. 7-0 game here. Now he's scrambling. Under pressure. He's at the 30. Brought down right around the 26-yard line. the catch and look out and he is drilled at the 12 yard line up the middle for a nice game touchdown Broncos They'll line up for the extra point in an attempt to tie the game. And he converts the extra point. Let's get the latest now from Reese Davis. Let's check in what's happening in Iowa City. And for Iowa, all the ingredients look as if they are starting to fall into place for a potential upset. We played one. We get a tie game at 7-7. the sack. Minnesota's got a guy behind center that can really do it all, Herbie. I mean... He's scrambling. Tries to fit it in there, and it'll be intercepted. And he's tackled at the 30. he demonstrate his leaping ability, but he also has the hands to be able to pull the ball in. Great job. The 10. Touchdown, Golden Gophers. Minnesota, up six. He splits the uprights with the extra point. A short three-play, 30-yard drive. And the result, seven points. Let's go one more. Ready. Here he goes. He's at midfield. At the 30, to the 20, to the 10. And he will score. quarterback 
plus an open field equals touchdown. And you know what? He's just a football player. The word quarterback isn't the first thing that comes to mind when I hear this kid's name. He's one of the very few guys that I would classify as just an all-around football player who does anything it takes to win. And he tacks on the extra point. A quick two-play, 82-yard drive, and they put up seven points. Boy, that is scoring in a hurry. This off. He's to the 40. And he's finally taken down at midfield. Under heavy pressure. Runs with it, and he's got room. Slides down. They're eating up a lot of field on this drive. I'm really impressed with their ball control. Golden Gophers use their second timeout. That's a great tackle at the nine yard line. That's good. That makes it seven and six. Eagle! Quick, quick, quick! Quick, quick! Quick, quick! Quick, quick! Complete. He's hammered. Intercept. No, he dropped it. You never know what will happen when the ball ricochets like that. Good effort by the defender. The kick is up, and he got it. Reese Davis is standing by with this update. Reese, all eyes on Iowa City. We've been watching this thing all day long. And for you're right, something has got to happen with his teammates, the rest of this group. They've got to raise their game if they want to have any chance of winning this game. Sends it out quick, intercepted. And he's taken down at the 30-yard line. He is up a field goal. They bring him down, and that'll be the second time that he won. Great game in the works, folks, as we come to the end of the first half. 17-14, Golden Gophers. And they make the stop right around the 18-yard line. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Thomas picks up about four yards on the play. That makes it seven and six. The lineman got a little ahead of the snap count. Here's the call. Ball start. Ball start. Awesome. Now he tries to buy some time. Brought down around the 17-yard line. Holmes gains about two yards on the scramble. Is up by three. Throws it in a hurry. A huge play, and now they're in a great position to score. Throws quickly, and it's almost intercepted. You like a team that's ready to defend the pass. It takes some preparation to get in the way of a pass like that. Here we go! out of bounds at the four-yard line. Jackson picks him up two yards with that catch. That makes it set. Set. Ready. Nice. He's scrambling. And now the ball is loose. Using those good hands, he scoops up the fumble. Yep, and this is why you need to know where the ball is at all times. Kicks away, and he's got it. Let's go to the studio for this Reese Davis update. The Hawkeyes came into the game ranked fifth. After that performance, 
they'll drop like a stone. Looks like this one's going to come down to the final quarter. The Golden Gophers in front by six. And he's tackled at about the 39-yard line. Fires out to his wideout. Tackle at the 21. I credit the quarterback on that pass. And we're all tied up. Trying to take the lead. Here's the extra point. He splits the uprights with the extra point. Let's get an update now. Here's Reese Davis. Reese. The Sooners were ranked number two. And after that performance, everyone knows why. And for Oklahoma, today's win gives them eight on the season. Makes it out to about the 19. And that's their third first down of the drive. Three to go in regulation. The Cavalry's coming. He scrambled. And down he goes at about the 17-yard line. One, maybe two yards on the quarterback. Here we go. On play action. They'll bring him down at the 15-yard line. Gain of two, two on the play. play. Third, Third down. Check 59. Mike. Mike is 59. Makes it to the 12-yard line. Boise State's going to use their first time out of the half here. And the halfback carries for a pickup of three. Kicks up. And it's through the uprights. And that gives them the lead. I know that I call kickers head cases, but this kid isn't one. Good decisions to move his offense down the field. A little over a minute in the game. Quarterback's going to run it, and he's got room to work. He's taken down at the 37. Here he goes. Slides down. Great run there to get the first down. Again, the option play here is such a tough play to defend. Makes the first down catch. And they make the stop around the 18-yard line. Nice run up the middle. Cody gains seven yards on that play. Take the lead. Boise State staff is so lucky they got a multi-dimensional quarterback. Nothing is more dangerous to a defense than dealing with a quarterback that can run and throw. And this time he uses his feet to get into the end zone for a crucial touchdown in this game. And they're looking to get two points here. And they get the two. So with very little time remaining here in the ballgame, our score, Boise State 29, Minnesota 23. Here we go! 319! He's under pressure, decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. He's at the 40. That tackle just sealed the deal. This one's in the books. The Broncos take this one. 29-23. That does it for this edition of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying so long.